I don't know which one of you little stanky, nasty booties came out the house and gave me this stomach flu. Okay, but I hit up my girl's antibiotics. They said you tried it. Stomach bugs. <laughs> Hey guys, this is Alex James. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you are all doing amazing. If you are brand new here, click the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, and it will notify you every time I upload a new YouTube video. No, I have not done my hair. I better not see that in the comments. This is not I Spy. I am just now getting over a little stomach bug, a little stomach virus. It hit me so hard last night. I went and got Panera bread, that little broccoli and cheese bowl, cheddar soup, and on my way home, threw up in the whole bag, threw up in my car. He was bad. The mugshot that we we're going to be reacting to today is the same mugshot of the whole reason why I got a warrant for my arrest. Okay, this is the same case. Those of y'all that know, the part one and part two, the police officer, and then the California block my ID. Okay, all this is the same case. How this is still going on, I have no idea. This was two years ago. Got a lawyer, got it taken care of. I got this in two days. Why didn't I receive a letter a year and a half ago? And forget the letter. As diligent as I was about this case, constantly talking to his assistants, because he was always, you know, in court, constantly getting updates from it. Never did they tell me I had to do 30 hours of community service. So forget a letter. Some little assistants apparently won't do their job. That's why they got fired. I literally, all I had left to do was pay $125 to the court and do 30 hours of community service, which is so bullcrap because again, I did. Okay. It's like opening up a late Christmas present. Okay, here's my original ticket. Ew, the way I said ticket. Ticket. Congratulations. We are successfully reducing your misdemeanor citation, which results in $125 fine to the Superior Court and 30 hours of community service in North Carolina. You have until January 23rd of 2019. Like, I literally got this two days ago. But again, I talked to my lawyer. He said he's going to court for me. And I just got to pay $125 and then do the community service. Whatever, I'm here to do my 30 hours. I'll do a video on that too. Got to figure out where I'm going to do some community service then. They hook me, cook me, and book me for absolutely no reason. Now, this mugshot. First of all, don't cover my eyebrows. Okay, they are thinner than my patients. So, watch yourself. Second of all, Look at how terrified I look. Like I was saying in that video, I had no idea what he was going to do to me once I got into the car. He pulled me over for absolutely no reason, then being super aggressive, had his taser gun out. All that was going through my head was, I'm literally going to be one of those people that end up on TV, dead, back off. And I had even told the sergeant lady when she showed up, because remember the guy called like four or five cops for absolutely... So when the sergeant showed up, I was like, look, I do not feel safe in his car. He is out there telling you guys lie after lie, and I am just completely discombobulated. I'm terrified. Get me out of this car, please. I'll go to jail if I got to go to jail. I don't want to ride in his car. So I ended up riding in this other guy's car. He was such a butthead too. Like I was just like, okay, where am I going? He's like, you're going to jail. Okay. But why? And like, what? Can I ask questions? Like, <coughs> no, I can't be screaming. I can't be screaming. Oh my God. The stomach bug is really here. Like she has it going away. So I was telling that guy on the way over, I was like, look, I know that I can't prove this to you right now, but I have a YouTube channel and I'm about to break this whole thing down. I'm about to be FBI, CSI. Okay, and you're gonna need an MRI because your head's gonna be blown. This cop is crooked. It was absolutely ridiculous. And you can see it in my eyes. Again, my mugshot would be like, stop. Or, ooh, here again. I was literally like, um, okay, like what happens at this point? How long do I stay here? It was cold. They gave me a stanky blanket, stanky clothes, and a hard bed. Yeah, I played a prisoner on TV. His name was D.B., and it wasn't like that. Do y'all remember that episode of Mysteries of Laura I was in? I actually did a reaction video to it. I'll put a little thing going across the screen. I'm so sorry my chair is farting. <laughs> Forget me. I also want to do a video of me face-tuning my mugshot for my main channel. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see that. I also have to do the story time of me getting kicked out, why I got kicked out of my house. We're getting there. All right, guys, I will see y'all later this week. Hopefully I can exterminate this bug overnight because look, these bugs all bad. My diarrhea real. I'm riding that toilet taking Tylenol pills. This needs to go. I'm done. Can you see my nipples? Yes, you can. Wow. Oh, my tummy. 